Hi, welcome to your first workout. My name is Danny, and I'm gonna be your trainer. Now this workout has been designed to target your full body. We're gonna be doing exercises that work your upper body, your core, and your lower body. Before we get started, I'm just gonna talk you through what equipment you're gonna to need to get out of your weight gym, and then we will crack on and get into the workout. So you're gonna need the unit itself. You're also gonna to need to make sure that you've got some resistant bands, some ankle and wrist straps and some handles removed from your unit. Okay, so before we get started, I just want you to make sure that the unit weight is suitable for you. So we're gonna be doing things like squats, lunges, bicep curls, those kind of things. So make sure that the weight is suitable for you. So pop, pop this video on pause, find the right weight for you and join back in. Throughout the workout, if you do feel like it's a little bit too much or perhaps too easy, all you need to do, again, just hit that pause button and adjust the weight. That is the beauty of the weight gym. You can tailor it specifically to your fitness levels. As I said, this is a full body workout. We are gonna be doing three circuits three rounds. Each exercise we're going to do for 40 seconds and have a 20 second rest. Okay, so what I'll do to start off with is talk you through the exercises. I will show you some easier options and the harder options. So you, again, you can tailor it specifically to you and then we will get started. So number one, so this is the first circuit. So there's three exercises we have got a squat to a lunge. So I'm gonna show you on a side angle, okay? So option here, use your unit, okay? Or if your unit is too much, you can either just use body weight or some dumbbells, okay? So a squat to lunge, what you're gonna do is pop your feet a little bit wider than your hips, probably shoulder width apart. You're gonna take a deep breath in and drive your hips backward, keeping your chest up. So deep breath in here and come up. Then you're gonna go into a lunge, so take a wide step back, lunge, back into centre, squat, and lunge. Okay, so with your lunge, just make sure you find your balance first. Pretend you've got a piece of glass in front of you, behind you, so you're keeping your chest nice and upright, and lunging down towards the floor. Okay, so the easier option is squat, come back up, then go into your lunge, step back in, squat and then lunge. Harder option is just to increase the tempo a little bit, okay? So you go squat into a lunge, squat into another lunge, okay? Take it to your level. Number two is a deadlift to a bicep curl. So this one works your hamstrings, your glutes and your biceps. Okay, so this one, what you're gonna do, pop your feet Again, shoulder width apart. This is all about driving your hips backwards towards the back of the room. Keeping your chin tucked, you have a slight bend in your knee. Rock your body forwards, keeping those legs nice and still. Feel that stretch in your hamstring, the backs of your legs. Come up and then curl the unit towards your shoulders and back down. Option here, use some dumbbells if the unit's too heavy, okay? And just slow down the tempo. Number three is a squat press. So I find it easier to flip the unit over so that the logo is facing towards the floor. Okay, so this is just a squat to start off with. Deep breath in, drive the hips back, squat, and then push your unit above the head. Okay, harder option is increased tempo, so it's a power move, drive. Easier option, squat, come up, press. They are your three exercises of circuit number one. We're gonna do 40 seconds of each exercise, have a 20 second rest in between, and repeat three times. And then I'll show you circuit two and circuit three. So this workout should last around 30 minutes, okay? If you do need a rest at any time, please just hit the pause, grab yourself a drink, and get back in when you're ready. Making sure that you've got a two meter space around you, you've got some water on hand, and you're probably gonna need a towel because it's gonna get super sweaty. Okay, we're gonna get straight in then. So I'm gonna set the timers, just make sure that you've got all the equipment out. So as I said, handles, ankle wrist straps, resistant bands, and the unit itself. Okay, so we're gonna gently roll our arms backwards. Deep breaths in and breathing out. Just getting the body warm. 
Just make sure you've got enough room around you guys. So you should have a two meter by two meter space. Roll forwards. That's it, good. Okay, we're gonna start taking it into a slow jog on the spot now. That's it, good. Okay, punching up. Perfect, we're here for another 10 seconds and then we're gonna take it into some star jumps. Good, ready in three, two, and one. Okay, into star jumps. If you can't do both feet, that's absolutely fine. You can do single feet. As long as you keep moving, you feel your heart rate getting faster. That's all that matters. Good, last five, four, three, two, and one, good. Okay, we're now just gonna warm up the backs of our legs called our hamstrings. Okay, you wanna come into a wide stance, hands above your head. You're gonna reach down to one side, so opposite hand to opposite foot. Push your bum backwards, so I'll show you from the side. Push. Try and keep your back parallel to the floor, making sure you're not rounding your back like this. Should feel a nice stretch down in the backs of your legs. Good, we're gonna go for five more. Should be feeling a little bit warmer by now. Good, and last one, well done. Okay, one more exercise of our warm up and then we're gonna get straight into it. Okay, wide stance again, so you want your feet wider than your hips. What you're gonna do is pop your hands out in front of you. We're gonna take a deep breath in. Sit back as if you're, you're sitting behind it on a chair. Deep breath and push, good. Deep breath and breathe out, that's it. So you're gonna try and come down to a 90 degree angle. So we're not here, we're down here and up. That's it, just warming up your legs, preparing ourselves. Four more, four, three, good. Two more, one, two, good. That is your warm up done. So let's get straight into the workout. Have some fun. Hope you enjoy it. All right, team, we are off. Squat to a lunge. So we're going to squat, lunge, squat, and lunge. Keeping that chest upright. Good. Remember your easier option. If you can't keep up with me, do not worry. This is your workout. You take it to your level. That's it. Good. So, easier option, stand, lunge, back in to a squat, back up, lunge, into a squat. If the unit's too much, take it away and just use body weight or dumbbells. Okay, we've got two seconds and one, rest. 20 seconds rest. And then we're gonna go into a deadlift, into a bicep curl, okay? Deep breath, grab a drink if you need to. Getting ready in five, four, three, two, and one. So pushing those hips back, keeping your chin in, slight bend in your knee, feel that stretch in the back of your legs. Come up, curl, down. Push back, up, and curl, nice. Nearly halfway, guys. Good work. Keep that up. Coming up to 15 seconds more work. Good, 10 seconds, stay focused. Keep that chin in, push those hips back. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Lovely work. Again, 20 second recovery, and then we've got our final exercise of this circuit is a squat and then a press. Okay, deep breaths. Another five seconds more rest. Should be feeling a bit warmer now. Ready, keep that chest up, deep breath in. Squat, push, squat, and press. Lovely work, doing really well. Stay with me guys, don't worry if you can't keep up. As I said, this is your workout, you take it to your level. Try and keep your bodies moving as much as you can. You are over halfway, 15 seconds left. 
Good. Keep going. Last ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Okay, we're going to have a 40 second rest now. Grab a quick drink. How are we feeling? Heart rate should be up now. Feeling a little bit warmer. Are we ready for round two? Okay, another 20 seconds rest. We're going to start at the top then into squat lunge and deadlifts to bicep curl and squat and then press. Okay, so you know the exercises now. So this round is all about trying to speed it up a little bit, get that heart rate up a little bit more and really start burning these calories. Are we ready? Okay, exercise one, squat, lunge, squat, lunge. Yes, good. Keep that chest up, keep breathing. Deep breaths in and out. Nice work, guys. Coming up to halfway. That's it, 20 seconds left on the clock. Come on, feel that burn in your legs. Push through. Nice work, 10 seconds. Woo, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And breathe, 20 seconds rest. And then exercise two, deadlifts to bicep curls. Are we ready? Eight, seven, six, five. Deep breath, roll the shoulders back. Three, two, go. Lovely, really feel that in the backs of your legs, pushing down in your heels as you come up, curling up. Drive, good. Just making sure you're keeping your elbows tucked in when you're curling up. Lovely work, team. You are smashing this. 10 seconds left. Good, last five, four, three, two, rest. Well done. Squat to press. Okay, 20 seconds rest. Then round three is coming. These exercises are then done. We move on to circuit two. Okay, ready? Five, four, three, two, go. Push, deep breath, push. That's it, come on. Drive that unit above your head. If it's too much, just squat and then push from the bottom. Just take it slower. Squat, come up. Push back down. Lovely. Great work, guys. 15 seconds. 10 second countdown. Ready? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, rest. 40 seconds, and then we are into round three. This is your last round of these exercises. And then we move on to three brand new exercises. Take a deep breath, grab yourself a drink. Okay, another 20 seconds. And then we're into our final round before moving on. How are we feeling? Legs are burning yet? My quads are feeling it, definitely feeling that burn. Such a great feeling though when you feel that. And then tomorrow you know that you're in trouble. <laughs> Are we ready? Okay. In three, two, and one. Off we go. Squat, lunge. If you can, stay low. If it's too much, don't worry. Just come up to a squat. Go into that lunge. Back into the squat into the lunge. Great work guys, 20 seconds left. Last 15. 10 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, 
four, three, two. Yes, great work. Deadlift to bicep curl, squat press. Round one, done. Circuit one, should I say, not round. What are we thinking? We've done three rounds. <laughs> okay, ready? Five, four, three, two. Roll the shoulders back, deadlift, down, curl. Yes. Good. Keeping that core nice and tight. Breathing in on the way down, out as you come up. Good. 20 seconds to go. Last 15. Come on, you've got this. This is it now. 10 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Okay, ready for squat press. 20 seconds recovery. And then we're on to circuit two. Ready in five, four, three, two, and one. Off we go. Squat, push, squat, and push. Lovely. Remember, you can slow it down if you need to. Deep breath. Squat, up, push. That's it, guys. You have got 20 seconds left. Good. Coming up to 10 second countdown. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Give me one more, two. Lovely. Grab yourself a drink. I'm going to show you your next three exercises. So for this one, you're going to need to attach one band onto each side of your unit. Okay, so it's really simple to do. All you need to do is open up your carabiner, attach it to one of the eyelets on the side of the unit and the other side, and then pop a handle onto each band. And that's it, you're set. So, your first exercise is going to be targeting the chest and the shoulders. So, you're going to be standing onto the unit, palms facing outwards, okay? From here, you're going to come up towards your shoulders, hands meet in the middle, and come back down. You're then going to turn your hands so your palms are facing inwards and out to the side, okay? So, from here, squeeze your chest back down out to the side, so it's chest and then shoulders. Then we're gonna do press up to shoulder tap. So there's a couple of options here, depending on your fitness level. So you can either do on your feet, press up, down to your knees, shoulder tap, okay? And then press up again and then tap the other side. If that's too much, what you can do is make sure that your knees are underneath your hips, Gripping the handles of the unit, taking a deep breath in. Press down, shoulder tap. Press down, other side. Okay, then we've got kettlebell swing. So for this one, you're gonna need to detach your bands. Okay. Gonna pop your legs a little bit wider than your hips. Okay, with this one, it's similar to the deadlift, so you're gonna hinge your hips backwards, rock your body forwards. Okay, slight bend in your knees, so that's your starting position. And then first up, swing the unit. Okay, so it's a nice flowing movement, working your whole body. All right, that is your three exercises. Are we ready? I'm gonna give you 10 seconds to get into position. Okay, ready, so starting off, standing onto the unit, chest fly, up, out to the side, up, and out, good. So with your lateral raises, this is working your shoulders, just come up to shoulder height, and chest fly, squeezing that chest, good. 
Lovely work. You have got 10 seconds left. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lovely. Okay, whilst we're resting, just remove those bands. Gonna come into a press up and shoulder taps. Are we ready? In five, four, three, two, one. So, easier option, knees underneath your hips. Tap. Okay, if you wanna make it a little bit more challenging, you can pop your knees out so your thighs come down at the same time and then tap. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, if it's easier, you can remove the unit and just do it body weight, tap. Last 10 seconds. Good work, keep going, keep going. Give me one more. Perfect, well done. 20 second recovery and then we're into our kettlebell swings and that's round one of circuit two, done. Are we ready? Roll the shoulders back, deep breath in your position. In three, two, and one, swing. That's it. Just a shoulder height. Nice. Squeezing your bum at the top, rocking your body forwards. Good work. You can also hold the unit so the logo is facing you. Whatever's best and most comfortable for you. 15 seconds. Good, last 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and rest. Good job, guys. You are absolutely smashing this workout. Hopefully you're feeling the burn. If you're not, we've still got a little bit to go. <laughs> Grab yourself a drink. We've got five seconds before we start again. Okay, just attach the bands and we're gonna go into our chest fly and lateral raise. All right, ready? In three, two, and one, go. Good, nice and controlled. You don't wanna let your hands drop like this, okay? You wanna control it up and nice and slowly on the way down. Then out to the side. That's good work. 20 seconds left. Come on guys, you're over halfway now. Good. 10 seconds, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Just remove those bands, getting ready for our press ups in 10 seconds. Okay, are we ready? Off we go, press, tap. Good work. Oh, I'm really feeling the burn now, guys. Hopefully you are too. Come on, push yourself now. 20 seconds left. Amazing work. You have got 10 seconds. Just make sure that your hands are over, sorry, your head is over your hands, okay? Getting the maximum benefit from this exercise. One more. Good. 20 seconds rest into kettlebell swings and that is round two done. We've got one more after this before we move on to our final circuit. Are we ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Good. That's it guys, 
killing it. You have got 20 seconds left on the clock. Perfect work. Coming up to 10 seconds. Come on, stay focused. Ready, five, four, three, two, Ooh. and relax. Okay, gonna give you a little bit of a longer rest before we start circuit. No, we've got one more round and then we start circuit three. Okay, another 20 seconds. Okay, round three. In position then, just attaching your bands. Last time. Okay, if you want to make this more challenging, you can add on a heavier resistance band, but I think this one's just about right. Okay, are we ready? Off we go, up. And out to the side. Good. That's it, team. Doing amazing. Over halfway now. Good. Coming up to 10 seconds. Lovely work. Last five, four, three, two, Woo, one, well done. Okay, getting ready for press-ups. Ready in 10 seconds. All right, three, two, one, off you go. Head over your hands and tap. Remember your easier option, knees underneath your hips and just lowering your chest towards the floor and then tap. Good, coming up to halfway. 20 seconds. That's it guys, 10 seconds. Come on, give me three more. Deep breath, push, one. Two, one more, deep breath. Push, 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 shoulder tap, three. Yes, that is circuit two, done, big tick. One more circuit, we are done. Okay, so this is gonna be a little bit more cardio now to so get the heart rate up. So what I want you to do is attach your bands and also you may find it easier, I'll show you what the exercise is in a minute, um, but to attach your ankle and wrist straps as opposed to your handles, we'll show you in a second. Grab a drink whilst I'm just setting this up if you need one. Okay, so circuit three, we have got box jumps to start with. So with this one, just make sure your bands are facing in front of you so they're not getting in the way. Okay, as quick as you can, I'm just gonna jump on and off. Okay, ease your option, step it on and off, okay? Just slow down that tempo. Number two, Nordic ski, okay. So this is where I find it easier to use these rather than your handles. Just allows you to have a little bit more mobility in your wrists, okay? So with this one, you're gonna have a slight bend in your leg. Starting position, okay? So as if you're skiing. Raise the bands all the way above your head, creating that momentum through bouncing through your knees and keeping your chest up. Okay, then after that, you've got a plank. So just gripping the unit handles, option here, just to hold onto your knees. Rock forward into it so you feel that in your core. Harder option on your feet. Okay, are we ready? So box jumps to start. Gonna give you 10 seconds to get in position. Okay, ready in three, two, and one, let's go. Quick as you can, 
Set yourself a little challenge. How many jumps do you want to achieve in 40 seconds? Good. That's it, on and off. As I said, there is an easy option here. Step it, on and off. You can build up throughout the weeks to get to that jump, but for now, if that's all you can do, that's not a problem, okay? Keep going, you have got 10 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, rest. 20 seconds rest. Grab yourself a drink if you need to, and then we're gonna go into our Nordic skis. Okay, ready in 10 seconds. So you can pop these in your wrists. You can just grip on some, whatever's most comfortable. Okay, ready? Off we go. Good, that's it, keep going, keep going. Coming up to halfway. 20 seconds. Come on, really drive that band above your head. Woo! This is a full body exercise, this one. Feeling the burn. Good. Five, four, three, two. Oh, anyone else's shoulders on fire? Woo! Okay, into a plank. Getting down into position. We'll give you 10 more seconds rest. Ready? Five, four, three, two. Okay, you're gonna hold it like this or on your feet. Okay, squeezing your bum, keeping your hips nice and strong. You don't want them dipping, don't want them too high. You want your back. Nice and parallel. Good, guys. Well done, 20 seconds. Keep breathing. Good. 15 seconds, come on, keep holding, keep holding. Stay with me. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And relax, well done. Okay, have a 40 second rest before we move on to round two. How are we feeling? We are nearly through our first workout and you have absolutely smashed this. We've got six minutes and we are done. Okay, I'm gonna give you another 15 seconds rest before we get going into round two. All right, are we ready? 40 seconds, box jumps. Three, two, and one, go. Come on. Good, that's it. Keep breathing, keep breathing. You've got this, come on. Only one more box jumps after this and you're done. 20 seconds, get that heart rate up, burn these last few extra calories. Come on, drive, drive, yes. Jump, good, 10 seconds. Woo, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo, breathe. 20 seconds into Nordic ski. Oh, these are definitely the most challenging ones of this workout. Woo! Okay, ready in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. From here, drive up. Good. Anyone that's been skiing, you're probably a lot better than I am at this exercise. Woo! That's it, good. Come on. If it's too much, just slow down the tempo. Good, that's it. Remember, this is the beauty of the weight gym. It can be adapted to your fitness levels. Everything you've got now, 10 seconds. Come on, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, breathe. 20 seconds rest into our plank and we've got one more round. And this workout is done. 
Ready in 10 seconds. Oh. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold it strong. Making sure that your wrists are in line with your shoulders, okay? You're not rocked back here. You're not rocked too far over. Gripping the handles. Keeping those hips nice and strong. Good, guys. If it gets too much, remember you can drop to your knees. You have got 15 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Keep breathing through. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and relax. Well done. 40 second recovery, and we are on to our final round of this workout. Oh, deep breaths. You've got 15 more seconds recovery into our final three minutes of work. And that is it, guys. Workout one is done. You've done the hardest bit. You've turned up. You've got workout one out of the way. You're now into a routine. Keep up the great work. Stay focused for these last three minutes. Are we ready? Box jumps. Go. Good. Come on. How many can you fit in? 30 seconds. Set yourself a challenge. Set that number. Keep pushing until you hit that. Come on, come on. Good. 20 seconds. Come on, 15 seconds. This is it. Come on, come on. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Nordic ski coming up. 20 seconds. Ready. And breathe. 10 seconds. Ooh, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, go. Come on. Into our last two minutes. This is it. All of your energy that you've got left putting into these last two exercises. Good. Halfway. 20 seconds to go. Nice. Come on. Push. Up. Good. That's it. 10 seconds. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. One more. Yes. Ooh, last exercise, plank, down to our knees, ready in 10 seconds, 40 seconds left, this is it, you are done, last five, four, three, two, off you go, hold, good, try and catch your breath now, deep breaths in through your nose, out through your mouth, 30 seconds, that is all you've got. Good, keep holding those hips strong. 20 seconds, that is it, workout's done. Woo! Should be feeling that burn in your core. 10 seconds, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and relax. Ah, oh, that is workout one done. Full body strength complete. We're gonna just do a couple of stretches just to cool down and just to make sure that you can actually walk tomorrow. Okay, so the first one we're gonna go into is a lunge. So take one foot forward, okay? Just hold your hands in front of you, keeping your chest up. You're gonna push forward into your front foot and try and push that back heel down towards the floor and just hold it there. How did you find that? Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't worry if you couldn't do all of it, it's absolutely fine. Everyone starts at the beginning, don't forget. So just build it up gradually. I'd recommend doing this workout again, maybe a couple of times and you'll notice that every time you do it, it will get easier. 
So please don't feel deflated if you weren't able to complete it all. Swap sides. We've also got a really good exercise library. If there are some of the exercises, such as like the squats and lunges, um, that you aren't familiar with how to perform, you wanna make sure your technique is right, head to our YouTube channel, and there are um, videos in there that talk you through each exercise in a little bit more detail, so you can make sure that your technique is right. Okay, and then we're gonna stretch out our hamstrings. So, pop one leg forwards, one leg bent, Push your hips back, lean on your bent leg. Keep one leg straight. Good, swap sides. That's it, we're gonna go into one more stretch after this and then you are done. Perfect, okay, so you might wanna hold onto a wall for this just to help with your balance. I'm gonna pull one leg behind, try and connect your knees, push your hips forward so you feel a stretch down in the front of your legs. I always find it easier just to concentrate on a particular spot in front of me, otherwise I'm wobbling all over the place. That's it, and then swap sides. Good. Deep breath in, roll your arms back. And deep breath out, try and touch the floor. Just hold it there for another 10 seconds. Good, roll your bodies up. Give yourself a massive round of applause. Really, really well done for getting through that. Make sure that you keep an eye on our YouTube channel and our website, because we will be uploading more beginner workouts. If you've got any questions, please drop us a message, but I hope to see you soon.